all right so in this video i want to go through how to add this feature on your website because it took me a while to find it i couldn't find a solution and then finally i just googled the right thing and there's one article that showed us how to do this so it's pretty easy but also hard to find and it makes you it's pretty cool because it's 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 easy but it doesn't look easy to set up so like what i'm talking about is whenever you load a, a website and it has a video playing in the background if you haven't noticed since 2021 like march um google safari and other browsers won't let won't let music autoplay because it's annoying i mean have you ever gone to a site and then music just starts playing so the the, the video has to be muted <clears throat> and in elementor if you want to add this site um without like without buttons on it without um you know having to click to youtube and making it the background i guess i'll just show you but the point is you can now do this you can put a button anywhere you want on the video or anywhere on the site to, for that matter and you can um obviously make the sound play when people if people would want it to play and our client really wanted to do this so it's always good when you know you get pushed to your limit so let me show you guys how to do that and also how to set it up but i will say i got i mean we were able to set up the video and all that but what we weren't able to do was set up the sound and we found this on element how so it's really element how that showed us how to do this and i'm just going to walk you through it uh I should, i'll try to remember to link this in the bottom of the video but this is the answer and they did a great job like showing you exactly how to do it the only thing you have to do is like um give them your information for the javascript code in order to do it so all right so um i'm gonna edit with elementor and, and i'm just gonna i'm not even gonna rebuild it i'm just gonna show you how to do it and you just have to duplicate it for the for the for the mobile so all right so number one is if you want to make a hero banner like this uh you make a section so you add the little plus sign, you add a, a section, a whole section. And then what you want to do, as you can see, edit section, you want to go to style and then you want to, you want to put video and then you put the video link. So in order to make this work, it can't be YouTube. It can't be Mimeo. It has to be self-hosted. So there is a bit of an issue there that you can't, um, you know, it's not going to be the highest quality. You might have to, depending on your video, you might have to bring down the quality down so that it'll automatically play without it being choppy. We had to do that because our file size was probably way too big. Um, and so, um, yeah, so it has to be self-hosted. So to do that, you go to media, you just upload the video directly to your website. So you, then you copy the URL, you add it here. Um, I guess I'll show you guys how to do that. <laughs> so you go to library, media library, you either add new or you have it here. So like, for instance, you go, you click it and then you can copy the URL You can copy the URL. So we have the 720 and we have the 1080. And I'm not sure. We may have compressed the video file so that it works, but I'm not exactly sure. I just set it up and then it was optimized. Um, so even what's cool here too is like you can set up a, t a start and end time. So like our client, for instance, didn't want the logo to play at the very end. So what we did was cut the end out and then loop it. So play on mobile, privacy mode. Play once would obviously mean one time, but it loops because it knows, right? So you do that. After the, you do that, what you have to do is that's you know, the easy part. Then what you want to do is you want to add this icon thing. And to add this icon thing, you have to do a couple things. So number one is um, it's in this article. <laughs> so... <laughs> So it literally walks you through it. So number one is you got to go to advance on the hero section and name it hero section. I think you can name it whatever you want, but the JavaScript code has the, it has, um, it has hero section on there. So you might have to change it on the JavaScript. So I would just name it hero section. So you add the CSS classes on advance on the section. You, you add hero section. Then you add the video, which we've already done. So then what you want to do is you want to add the elementor. You want to add the icon. So you pick literally the one that they chose right here. Um, on the left-hand side, you do all this. And then this is where they show you how to make it, uh, how to make it stick where you want to. 
So like to put it here, when you initially put the logo, the logo, as you can see, it's right here. Um, it'll just be anywhere. I think it's like in the middle. So you have to go style it on advanced positioning, and then you put it where you want according to that. So I think we did it on the back end, but if you wanted to do it on the front end, you could do it here. Um, I am on the icon, right? Yep. And then, <laughs> so this is where you copy the code. And this is what makes it toggle on and off. And that's it. Once you put that in, it does everything else for you. So it's actually super easy to set up and do because they give you the code. If you had to write the code, that'll probably suck. Um, I'm just going to save this code here just in case we need it. Toggle music on off. So anyways, this video is more about, hey, go check out this code. So I'll put it in the description because that's all you need. Um, but it works. And here it is live. I, oh, sorry. So you just, I think it's just so cool. I, I didn't know you could do that. So number one is Google browser, the Chrome browser, the Safari browser. They won't, they won't let you play it automatically. So you got to do this. So that's how you notice if you go to YouTube and you right click a new, a new tab for a video, it won't automatically play. It'll wait until you get to that video for it to start playing. Because if you remember, you had to like open the tab, go to the video, pause it, and go back to the previous tab if you wanted to like open a bunch of videos up. I do that. Anyways, that's it. That's today's tip of the day. Um, it, it was hard for me to find it, so I just wanted to make a video because it might be easier to find on the YouTube channel and then click the link versus trying to find the, the link itself on a Google search engine. Okay, bye.